Hello everyone, welcome to Color Designs. The tool for today's lesson is quite familiar. It's eyedropper tool and gradient tool. If you are using uh, any other program, design program, if you are a designer, so you have been using uh, eyedropper and gradient tool before in other programs, I will give an example uh, for you to make it more easy to understand the eyedropper and the rest of the tools. Uh, if I have a picture right here and I needed the color palettes from it and the color samples so I will select eyedropper first I will take uh, some shapes and uh, I will select the eyedropper tool and select any point of the color which I need I will click on it as you can see at the top this color has been taken I will drop it on the shape to apply the color this is one time color selection so if I have to select more than one color at the, at the same time so I will um, have to press shift after selecting one color as you can see it's a bucket tool and I cannot select any more colors so if I have to change the color and change and take a new sample from the picture I have to press shift and I can take a new sample I will select it and drop it in the shape on my layers I will take another sample and drop it uh, like this I will I can take more than one color at the same time so this is the example basic example of a eyedropper tool hope you understand it it is uh, easy to use while using the shift uh, after this the next tool uh, will be the gradient as you can see in my document palettes I have a lot of uh, color samples right here collected so I will use them in my gradient I will select the gradient tool and apply it on my shape I will click and drag it so as you can see the gradient has been applied there are two different uh, types of gradient which are used commonly the first one is uh, linear and the second one is radial linear one is straightforward shape so the second one is uh, radial and uh, the radial is round shade applied to your design if you need uh, so this is the example of using gradient tool so you can change the shape the size the shade of the, your design by using this um, tool right here uh, i will use i will change the color if you want to change the color you have uh, two points right here one is filled with uh, orange color the second one is white you can change it by simply selecting the color from the bottom you was uh, you first have to click on the shape and go at the document palette and select any color then that color will be filled and your gradient there's another way to change your colors by clicking on the gradient and select your palette then go top at the top right here in your property bar you can uh, press on this arrow and you can change the color from here and select more different colors if you need then you have to come and select the other part and go again up there and change the color with uh, similar color shades then you can change easily your colors this is how you use gradient tool this is the basic way of using gradient tool if you have for example another shape and that shape is uh, filled with black color or maybe simple solid color and you have a hard time to collect these two colors combination to use uh, the gradient now there's an easy way you can select that uh, that shape and go in edit copy properties from and then if you need only the fill color or outline color or outline pen so i only need the fill color so i will tick mark on that one and i will press ok then i will come uh, point my arrow to this shape and press click on it left click so as you can see the field color is exactly the same and the gradient has been applied to the other shape this is the basic way of using the gradient hope you learn something if you have any questions kindly ask them uh, i will be more than happy to answer your questions thank you everyone have a nice day